Hello and welcome to this video on how to export and import remote systems using MaxView Enterprise Manager. MaxView provides the import and export systems to export the configuration of multiple remote systems together in a file that can be used later to import back the added systems in MaxView running on another system. The import and export feature gets enabled at the Enterprise View level. This slide explains the whole process theoretically. For example, System A is running with MaxView Storage Manager that adds multiple remote systems for storage management and then exports the system configuration of remotely added machines into a systemconf.json file. The file is then copied onto the target system, System B, which can be used to import the configuration of all the remotely added machines to System B. This enables the user to manage the storage of all the remotely added systems through System B. The next slide captures the topics we are going to cover in this video. How to export the remote system to systemconf.json file using MaxView GUI. And how to import the remote system in MaxView GUI. Now let's talk about how to export remote system configurations. To export a remote system, select the Enterprise View node. Now on the ribbon in the system group, click Manage Configuration. The Manage Configuration wizard opens for that system. Note that the export feature is applicable only when MaxView GUI manages at least one remote system. Now select the Export System option, then click Next. Select the systems that need to be exported. Also note, to get the details of the respective systems, hover the cursor on the system name. It shows details like system name, IP address, operating system, and communication protocol. Now click Next. The Manage Configuration Summary page appears. Click Finish. The exported systems are now downloaded in a systemconf.json file. By default, the file will be saved in the Downloads folder of your local directory. Now let's talk about how to import a remote system using MaxView GUI. Select the Enterprise View node. On the ribbon in the System group, click Manage Configuration. The Manage Configuration wizard opens for that system. Select Import System option, then click Next. Click Choose to specify the path of the systemconf.json file. The file gets uploaded under the Uploaded Configuration File field. Click Next. The Select System screen appears. Now select the system name and specify the login credentials. You can select Single Sign-On option to specify the username and password for all the selected systems that have the same credentials. Also note, Single Sign-On option is enabled only when more than one system is selected for import. Otherwise, specify each system's credentials manually. Click Next. The summary page appears that shows the list of imported systems. Then click Finish to import the listed systems. The imported systems will be available in the Enterprise View node. Thank you for watching this video on how to import and export remote systems from your network using MaxView User Interface. For more information about Smart Storage Products or MaxView Storage Manager, please visit us at microchip.com/smartstorage.